Okay, so the interview finished, and guess who's with me? The lovely Miss Whirl. Come on, stop playing peekaboo. Okay, say hi. Sorry, sorry. Hi, everybody. Can you say um, a box cover? Box cover! Lisa, I noticed something with you. You have this, I don't know if it's this habit, this hair flip thing. What is about the hair no, flip? No. Is actually, it that when you have hair? I don't. I saw I a video had... with you and J Dash, and you saw the camera, just, and it was just this thing. Let me just do this because my hair is always. Like this, but so it can't be like a rug, like it can't be just like you, you almost look very dainty doing it. The hair flip, so you're putting it in what you call this. Um, it's just a, a, is that what you call a bow in the door, though? Yeah, hi, everybody. Hi, so now you're not going to do any hair flip. No, okay, so talk to me, talk about what just happened a while ago. Well, for youth month, mm -hmm. what we're doing is focusing on young people who have for gone now. into no, well, who have gone into untraditional paths of different careers and vloggers, photographers, actors, sports, men mm -hmm. and women and really showcasing them on social media to say to other young people, look, there are other avenues that you can go into and it's okay to go into them. So mm -hmm. look out for Dr. Berry's story. It's actually very interesting. Um, you will hear that he really needed to be a doctor. Yeah. So different things. And so the hard life from there for walking, you know, go school in one foot of shoes. So it should be fun okay. and it should be very inspirational for a number of people because one of the things that I'm very clear about mm -hmm. is that everybody has uh, the best of themselves sometimes hidden very deep. That is true. And I really want to harness with your help and others mm -hmm. your best you. All of you as young people need to realize that you all have talents and sometimes mm -hmm. persons tell you that you don't and stories can help you yeah. say, you know, boy, I should have really gone in that direction, you know, because that person did it or this yeah. person did it. It's okay to do it. So, mm -hmm. that's just some of the things that we'll be doing. That's for why you. I'm doing what I'm doing. So, <laughs> years from now, somebody can say, Mom, I want to be a vlogger. And the mom will say, Okay. No, I want to be a little berry. Yeah, you know, and the mom can say, All right, then he did it and he's successful in the bar roadside. You exactly. know, they can have a person. And the world has, has so moved in a direction mm -hmm. that this is the best time. For persons to try new things, be creative because mm -hmm. you're it's open. It's yeah. open to new careers and opportunities. So now my question to you, Miss Hannah, what is it like being so beautiful? Seriously? Yeah, that, that is a question. It's a deep question, you know. It's a deep question when you preach because I often wonder when you come to speak to people, is it, do you sometimes feel as if it is just the Lisa Hannah thing and you want to say, hey, this is me really communicating and not be blinded by, oh my gosh, I'm Lisa Hannah. Because that must be irritating after a little while. I can look at it two ways. Mm -hmm. And I, I want to make it very a disclaimer mm -hmm. that I don't go around thinking that I am beautiful. Because yeah, even, I, when I pick I, up, yeah. Yeah, even when I went to this world, I certainly mm -hmm. didn't think I was the most beautiful That's person. That's why I want. Um, politically, I mm -hmm. think people thought I was a novelty, yeah. that I was a nine-day wonder who would mm -hmm. not have survived. Um, three terms later as member of parliament mm -hmm. for South East and overcoming many hurdles mm -hmm. and many fights and many battles. Mm -hmm. uh, what you now get is a certain degree of, and certainly from my constituency, mm -hmm. a lot of respect because persons who would have thought that, well, she could have gone in this direction mm -hmm. in acting or the movies or a model or something else mm -hmm. have now realized that the part of my personality or that part of my personality is not really where I want it to be. It yeah. was really about nation building, giving back, and that's who I, I was. In terms of Jamaicans, mm -hmm. I, I've grown up in front of Jamaica. Yeah. So from days of rapping to enter the yeah. dojo to... So in a so way, you also, right? Yeah, you used to the, a certain no, but response. I think mm -hmm. I think in terms of a response, people mm -hmm. are they more see me as a daughter. Yeah. And it's boy, she's really grown up, she's matured, she's turned into a, a lady. Or, and a lot of people are finding yeah. very surprised how chill and down to earth you are. You know, I see a lot of comments like, "Oh my God, she should have said hey, you should come." <laughs> Somebody said that they taught you to to dab. I don't yes, know, a friend of mine yes. said that they, they, they did some photo shoot and they thought you were to dab. Yeah. Oh, it was actually true. Yeah, okay, I was yeah. like, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, and I, it's, it, I think people sometimes don't realize that they, 
walking barefoot is my preferred option. Mm -hmm. I think it but is. But say a picture one time, I climb a mango tree. Yeah, yeah man. Then I follow that is, you're a tomboy. That is who I am. So that mm -hmm. is why I think I did karate and not. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, I'm afraid yeah, I know. Yeah, and yeah. stuff like that. So, but for me, it's mm -hmm. internally is more important to me than what yeah. is external. Good. And that is that will always be how it is. And I would like to say to young women out there, get comfortable in your skin mm -hmm. because the makeup, the eyelashes, the revealing of a lot of skin, mm -hmm. um, that's cool. That's fine. But you have to be able to wear that with confidence as well. So if it is that you are going to know have artificial stimulants to boost your confidence. Artificial Make sure stimulants. that the confidence is already there so that when you take it off, you don't fall apart. Yeah. And that you don't fall apart emotionally when something doesn't go for you the right way because you have when to prop yourself. Burst. When you have to prop yourself up with so many other things. Yeah. Get that core correct. Get the core strong. And that comes with time, it comes with experience, it comes mm. with challenges. And so you need to see every challenge perhaps as a stepping stone. And at the end of the day too, we're Jamaicans, we like style, 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 and style, you know, spoil. So I'm going to tell wow. nobody, say, look, don't dress up and don't yeah, go. Yeah. But make sure that when you do, when you step out, everything is balanced. The mm. confidence, the clothes, the, everything is balanced so that mm. nobody can say, that boy, it's fluff over substance. Yeah. You want it the other way around. You want substance over fluff. Okay, that's nice. All right, so last question. If you, you know, were to be a vlogger, you know, say that come give Dutty Bear some competition, what do you think you'd call yourself? Like, what would be your, your channel name? Like, you know, you have Quiet Bear, you have Prince Money, you have all kind of different names. What would you want to be the name for, like, your channel, like your brand as a vlogger? Picture, like, a Lisa that is that is 17, you know, you're going to start your channel. What would you want to be a channel I'm name? Worst person to ask that. Come on, find a nice channel name or what would it be about? Like a 17 year old Lisa. I'm really boring, you know. No, I don't think so. Yeah. Um, I probably have a self defense channel. How to That'd protect cool. yourself. You can start it now. Lisa kick ass. <laughs> That would go yeah, well. That would go well. And just teach people how to. You show that thing. That would be real cool. Yeah. That would be a good Instagram video. Call. Make sure that you set that up. Yeah. Well, thank you, everybody. Dr. Berry, as always, it's nice to see you. Yeah, man. Number one. <laughs> number one lady in my life. So there, Lisa. I know. Oh, so a lot of mercy. See that? I'm going to sell this on eBay. 20 million. <laughs> Somebody must buy it. Lira. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs>